Hey, this is Aaron with Faith to Walk Ministries, and this is going to be a short video to discuss a certain topic. Now, I did a video review of this one. It's the Fire Bible, the English Standard Version, and a lot of people go, oh no, you're using a different translation. No, King James Version is my all-time favorite preferred translation. I believe it is the most accurate from the manuscript evidence being the Northern Stream Antioch manuscripts from which we get the Byzantine majority text and the Textus Receptus. That is great. But a lot of people, they, they see maybe a study Bible or study helps, but it's not in the King James. Or in case with this one, it does come out in the King James, but only in bonded leather, which they want $100 for bonded leather. Mm, nope. Or it comes in hardbound. But if you want a genuine leather or a softbound in this, you have to go with either the English Standard Version or I think the MEV. And so the biggest thing is, do you, do you not do it? Because it's a different translation. Well, I'm gonna tell you one thing. What I do, I still have my other translations because I use them for many years. Did I throw them away? No, I use them for commentary. And so this is what I study, I read my devotions, I teach and preach from is the King James Version. This is the Schuyler Canterbury. And of course, I have some R.L. Allens. I have Cambridge as well. But the biggest thing is, what do you do? Well, you can still get these. Treat the text as commentary if you need to. Um, you can treat it as commentary. But the biggest thing, like this one, I did a big review, so I'm not going to go in depth. But it has awesome book introduction. It has awesome notes. It has theme finders throughout the Bible. Good cross-referencing. And it has... 70 articles explaining some major doctrines of the Bible in depth. It's a very good study Bible help. But I wasn't going to not get it just because the text was English Standard Version. And so this is just, once again, a short video saying, listen, don't be too hard on yourself. If you get one and you're so wanting a certain study Bible, because I tell you what, the ESV study Bible, the big thick thing, it has a lot of great information in it. The text I will consider commentary. But when I study in depth, I will use the King James Version. I have the Word of God today. I don't have to guess. I don't have to doubt. All the words are included. Once again, I have other videos up about the subject, but the biggest thing is oh, this Bible is beautiful. So, love the uh, King James Version. It is my preferred. But don't be fearful. Because some people might get something like this and think the text is going to make their fingers melt. It's not going to. And if you like the hardbound, hey, get the King James. I will probably end up picking one of those up anyway. This is something I'm going to have in the car. So it's going to be beat up, kind of thrown around a little bit. Hardbound, that would not do well. But the leather soft, leather flex, whatever, it will hold up well. Anyway, just a short video to say, hey. This is what I do, King James Version. It's my preferred. It's what I use. But if I want a study Bible and it has maybe another translation, but I'm getting it for the study helps. It's okay. Hey, thanks for watching. God bless.